Hello everyone, this is Amit Dan of AmitDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of unboxing and brief review video and I'll be unboxing the Aki 3 port USB-C hub card reader. This is not an affiliated view. All my reviews are non-affiliated, unbiased and honest and there is no affiliated links anywhere. So you can buy many USB hub on the market but I found them, uh, some of them are very uh, expensive. Uh, they're, they're just, you know, not priced uh, well and uh, the product quality is not even that good but you know uh, the, they uh, jacked up the price unnecessarily but uh, I have been uh, I have had uh, a few Aki products in the past and uh, they make very quality products and prices are reasonable as well so I picked this up on sale uh, which was about 20 Canadian dollars uh, but uh, if you if uh, this is not on sale then you can get it for about 30 Canadian dollars and uh, there are several versions of the same thing uh, the one I'm looking at right here doesn't have any HDMI port which I do not need and for that reason this is a lot cheaper than the other versions and uh, if you do not need uh, any HDMI output then I recommend this one so what I'll do uh, let's open up and uh, I'll uh, we'll take a look at it and then I'll give you some examples of you know how you can use this and this uh, device can come in very handy now, uh, especially if you're a photographer, videographer, or when you're traveling, and I have some uh, of my stuff here, which I'll show you, you know, how you can use this, and it can save you a lot of hassle and time. So, the package uh, came like this, and then uh, let's take a quick look here. So, on the back, we have here Aki USB C hub, uh, type uh, C, and for laptops, desktops, and there's the model number and that's looks like pretty much it so let's uh, open this so opening was a breeze and let's uh, open up the box here okay so looks like we have an instruction manual and I'll take it out. And uh, the box is empty. So let's set this aside here. So they touched a tiny instruction manual here. And then uh, let's just go over some of the uh, features here. So this is connected uh, via USB cable, uh, which is right here and then you have USB 3.0 port and then we have a micro SD and SD card slot which is right here okay so that looks like it here I'll just set this aside here and we'll uh, open this uh, right here so it comes in a plastic wrapper okay so the first thing uh, I'm noticing that this is very lightweight uh, it feels having no weight at all which is very good when you travel but it has that sort of plasticky feel uh, you can uh, see that you know uh, that it's obvious that it's made of plastic but the plastic doesn't look too bad quality and I have a feeling that you know this is going to be uh, going to give you a years of uh, lasting uses okay so we have uh, our micro USB cable right here and uh, these look like all uh, USB 3 and they're actually high speed USB 3 cable and then we have a micro SD card and a SD card slot now when I bought uh, these two laptops uh, this is a regular uh, Asus uh, laptop Windows and this is a Chromebook they have they only offer USB C so with the Chromebook which is right here right here so with the Chromebook, uh, they didn't give any uh, cable uh, or USB hub, but with uh, this Windows Asus laptop, I got this uh, Asus uh, hub. However, it doesn't have any uh, micro SD card slot. So what I had to do, I have to buy a separate one uh, when I travel. So I would have to take you know these two together. But with this, I don't have to you know do that anymore. So I can just like you know take this and then it should work. So this device actually is replacing these two. Okay, so let's say if you are 
you know voice recording on a digital voice recorder or if you are if you have are taking pictures or videos on your cell phone or if you're using your tablet and then let's say you have uh, you know pictures on your camera or uh, videos on your camera and if you'd like to do a backup then you're going to be uh, you know switching or transferring files from uh, these SD cards from here to a hard drive or portable hard drive or to your laptop so in order to do that you need something like this or this so you have to just like you know insert your micro SD card or SD card slot here and then once you insert this into your laptop and then you can insert the this side to your portable hard drive to back it up and let's say if you're not carrying your uh, laptop uh, you just only have your camera and your uh, voice recorder or your phone or your tablet and you still need to back it up then you use one of the uh, portable hard drives so you have to just you know uh, put this into your USB hub which is going to be right here and then you can insert your SD or micro SD card then you can insert the USB-C connector on your cell phone uh, you can do it this way or let's say you're uh, transferring data from your laptop uh, or Chromebook to hard drive then you can just slide this in into the USB-C port right here and if you're not using a portable hard drive then you can still back up your files from these devices to your laptop or tablet uh, just you know uh, you have to just use uh, take this out and then you can use another USB cable uh, to connect it this with uh, these devices so there are various ways you can use this and having everything all in one it saves you like you know carrying different uh, more than one uh, hub or card readers so because this is kind of all in one so so far I like what I see the only uh, thing I see here it's missing is that it would, would have been nicer to have another USB-C input so I don't see any USB-C input in here for example if you take a look at it here uh, this one has actually a USB-C input uh, for example like this but uh, this one doesn't have any USB-C input but it has you know high-speed USB uh, 3 uh, slot but having these uh, two micro SD and SD card slots def definitely would save you a lot of time because you know you can just uh, transfer files from one to another uh, using these very easily with this and uh, most of the times you possibly may not need another USB-C input here but let's say if you need that then you can use one of these uh, or you can just keep it in addition to this or you can just have another one which has USB input but for me I don't need to have another USB-C input in here so this is just works perfectly for me and I wouldn't need to carry uh, these two and this is going to make everything a lot easier when I travel next time or even when I use it at home so this uh, micro C USB hub with card reader I purchased this with my own money uh, it was not a uh, sent by the manufacturer or I didn't take money from anyone and there's no affiliated link so the reviews and opinions are honest unbiased and non affiliated thank you for watching forget about subscribing this channel forget about liking this video I'll see you shortly